receiving students and seven is? Thank you, take your seat. Receiving students and seven is? Our strength for today's lesson, we are still on space and shape. And our new sub strength is volume. And then we have our learning outcome there. So receiving students and seven is, we are in our new sub strength and new learning outcome. Now, our lesson topic for today is on volume. Now, before we go any further, receiving students and seven is, let me define the term volume. What is volume? Well, volume is the amount of space a three-dimensional object occupies. Now, on the screen, I have an example of a three-dimensional shape which has been given there. So the three-dimensional shape is a cube. It's a cube which has been shown. So cube is a three-dimensional shape, object. So the amount of space, volume refers to the amount of space a three-dimensional shape occupies. So receiving students and seven is, that's the simple definition for volume. Now let me introduce to you the commonly units that are used for volume. Commonly used units for volume of solid. Cubic centimeter. Now if you want to measure a volume of a Metz box, The volume of a match box is measured in cubic centimeter. And the volume is about 30, cent 30 cubic centimeter. A match box, the volume of a match box is about 30 cubic centimeter. Now, a cubic centimeter is the space occupied by a cubic meter, by a cube with size of one centimeter. So a cubic centimeter is the space occupied by a cube with side length of one centimeter. So receiving students, one of the units of volume of solid is known as or is cubic centimeter. Now we have another commonly used units for volume of solid, which is cubic meter. And a cubic meter is the space occupied by a cube with sides of one meter. Now receiving students and sev uh, seven is, I will show you a cubic meter of one, a cube or a three-dimensional object which has a size of one meter. Its sides are one meter in length. So can I have JJ, Michael, Emmanuel, and Donald? Now students, what you can see here is a cube with a side, all sides, length of one meter. So, the volume of this cube is one cubic meter, as you can see here. This is a cube which has a side length of one meter, all sides one meter, which makes up a volume of one cubic meter. Thank you very much. Uh, for students, you can take your seat.
Now, receiving zero and seven is what I have just shown you is a cube, which has a side length of one meter. And one of the common, uh, commonly used units for volume of solid is cubic meters. Now, let us look at our learning activity. Receiving students, on the screen we have our learning activity. Now, our learning activity is how many cubes are in the solid shape? We have a shape which has been given. Receiving students and seven is, I want you to find the number of cubic, um, the number of cubes which are in the solid shape. Receiving students and seven is, shouldn't take you that long. I'm giving you two minutes to complete the learning activity. Okay, receiving students in seven is two minutes up. Let's have some answers. Evelyn, how many cubes are in the solid shape? 21 cube. 21 cubes. Kalen? Receiving students, I hope you are doing the same thing. Please give your answers to your teacher. Twenty one cubic centimeter. Twenty one cube. Okay, twenty one cubes. Any other? Okay. Now receiving students and seven is. If you look at the solid shape, or the shape, the solid shape that has been given, how many layers does it has? It has three layers. Yes, it has three layers. The first layer, which is the bottom one, how many cubes does it has? It has? How many? There are 12. The first layer has 12. Let's save it as layer one. Has 12 cubes. Layer two, how many cubes? How many cubes? Six. Okay, six. Six cubes. And layer three, which is the top one. How many? Three. three. Total of how many cubes altogether? 21. 21 cubes. Now, 21 cubes makes up that solid shape. The next question is, receiving students and seven is, what is the volume of the shape? in cubic centimeter. <laughs> Any
Any answer? Receiving students and seven is receiving students. Please give your answer to your teacher. From the model class, let's have uh, Lisa. Twenty-one cube centimeter. Yes. Receiving students and seven is the volume of the shape in cubic centimeter is twenty-one cubic centimeter. Receiving students, I hope you have given the same answer to your teacher. So if twenty-one cubes makes up that solid shape, then the volume of the Solid shape will be 21 cubic centimeter. Now receiving students and seven is. How did we come up with the volume of the cube? What, are, what is the method that we use to find the volume of the cube? Receiving students and seven is. Please tell your teacher. Let's have Shannon. Addition. Shannon, can you explain further on, on how you used addition to come up with the volume of the shape. Add all the layers. Okay, add, add in all the layers. Okay, from the layers, what do we have? Receiving student and seven is. Shannon said that by adding the layers, but from the layers we have what? What do we have? Cubes. Yes, we have the cubes. So what, what is the general method to come up with? The volume of the shape. Yes, Lisa. Counting the cubes. Okay. Very simple method by counting the cubes, which makes up that shape. So the simple method that you can use is to find the volume of the shape in this lesson is just counting the cubes which are being given in the shape. So counting the number of cubes that makes up the shape gives you the volume of the shape which is uh, shown. So receiving students and seven is, you can also count the vol number of cubes to find the volume of the shape. Now let us move on to our activity. We have our activity there. Exercise one. Find the Volume of the following solids, each small cube represent one cubic centimeter. Receiving students and seven is. What does that mean? Receiving students, can you explain to your teacher what does that mean? Each small cube represent one cubic centimeter. Does it refer to the whole, the, the whole shape or does it refer to the small cubes that makes up the shape? Receiving students and uh, seven is, can you tell your teacher? Let's have uh, Michaelin. Michaelin, what does that statement mean? Each small cube represents one cubic meter. What, what does it refer to? The four sides of the Cube is one centimeter. Thank you, Michaelin. Okay, that statement simply refers to the small cubes that makes up the shape. One of those small cubes, the volume of it is one cubic centimeter. Receiving students and seven is. So if one of those cubes is equal to one cubic centimeter, then what is the volume of the whole shape? That's the hint there to answer the questions or exercise which are given. So receiving students and seven is your exercise one, you have to find the volume of the following solids, A and B. I'm giving you three minutes to do exercise number one. After three minutes, we will then move on to exercise number two.
Kevin teacher, you can move around and supervise your students. Okay, three minutes up, we will move on to our next exercise. Receiving students in 70s, our next exercise number two is on the screen. Find the volume of the following solids. You have A and B. Receiving students in seven years, I hope you have completed all the exercise which have been given. Now, for this uh, 
time, we will correct the exercise. So, receiving teacher, please select four students to write their answer on the board. From the model class, I will have Win, uh, Ruti, Lisa, and Malvin. Okay, can I have those four students on the board to write the answers? Win, 1A, Lisa, 1B, Ruti, 2A, and Malvin, 2B. Uh, Win, please, can you show your waking out? Show your waking out, show your waking out, show your waking out. Yes, one day, one day. It will be. Show you waking up. Yeah, yeah. Show you waking up. Yeah, waking up. Sorry about that. You step one, you step one. Okay, give it to Thank you. Thank you, Melvin. Okay, receiving students in seven is. Let's correct, uh, look at the answers which have been written by our four students here from the model class. Now, exercise one, A, we have the shape there. How many layers does the shape has? Okay, it's about four layers or two layers. If you see it the other way around, it has two layers. The other way around, it has four layers. So, our friend here has used, one layer has four cubic centimeter, or one layer is made up of four cubes, which is equal to four cubic centimeter. And the other layer is also four cubes, which is equal to four cubic centimeter. So the total volume of the shape that makes up that cube is eight cubic centimeter. Now let us look at exercise B. Eight cubic centimeter, receiving students in seven is. Does, is the shape, is the volume of the shape or solid four cubic centimeter, eight cubic centimeter? Yes. Yes. Two layers. The top layer is four cubes, which makes up or which is equal to four cubic centimeter. And the bottom layer has another four cubes, which is equal to four cubic centimeter, which makes up the volume of the shape, eight cubic centimeter. 
Now, exercise number two. We have two layers there. The first layer, layer one, how many cubes there? Okay, the first layer is how many cubes? The first layer is the bottom layer. Okay, the first layer is three cubes, you can see, okay? And the top layer, which is the second layer, has one. One cube. Layer two. So, which makes up total of four cubes. So, if there are four cubes that makes up the volume of the shape, then what is the volume of the shape? Four cubic centimeter. Now, exercise B, which is much complicated uh, solid there. How many shapes, uh, how many layers can you find? There are many layers that you can see from the shape. How many? Three, three layers. So the bottom layer, how many cubes? Nine, nine cubes makes up. Nine cubes, there are nine cubes, so what is the volume? Nine cubic centimeter. The second layer, how many cubes? Nine cubes, which is also nine cubic centimeter. And the third layer, we have six. One side, three, and the other side, three. So three cubic centimeter plus three cubic centimeter. Total volume of 24 cubic centimeter. So receiving student in 70s. If you did not get the answer correct, please do corrections. Now receiving students in 70s. Our summary. Receiving students in 70s. Can you read the summary point? Summary point one. One, two, read. Okay, so that is the meaning of volume. We are summarizing the lesson now, receiving students in seven is. So the volume is the amount of space a three-dimensional shape occupies. And what are the commonly used units of volume of solid, receiving students in seven is? Cubic centimeter and cubic centimeter. Okay, cubic centimeter and cubic meter. And our key phrase for today, receiving students in seven is, a cube with sides of one centimeter has a volume of one cubic centimeter. That's our key phrase for today, receiving student. So, if a cube with sides of one meter, what do you think is the volume? If a cube has a size of one meter, what do you think is the volume receiving student in seven is? Evelyn. One cubic centimeter. I repeat, if a cube with size of one meter, what is the volume? The sides are one meter. What is the volume receiving student in seven is? Kalen. One cubic centimeter. One cubic centimeter. Okay, let's have JJ. Hurry up. One cubic, one cubic meter. Very good. One cubic meter. Thank you, JJ. Let's give two big claps for uh, to JJ. Well receiving students and seventies. That's all for today. And our next lesson topic is on volume of a rectangle. Uh, volume of a rectangular. With that, receiving students and 70s, thank you very much for your participation.